Well, good morning, YouTube. The other day when we moved the five-frame nukes into big boxes, we noticed that they had uh, pretty much no stores at all, so we figured we must be in a dearth. Now, the front hives, we've put a feeder in each hive, but we only had enough for the front hives, so the back, back bee yard back here, uh, we had to order new feeders. So I thought in temporary, we'd, uh, we'd open feed back here. Uh, you put this out yesterday, that's a three gallon chicken water, and down in the blue tr or the uh, red tray I've put fish tank gravel so that the bees don't drown in there. And it was empty last night when I got home. So I figured, oh, there's no way they drank three gallons of sugar syrup in a day. And there was gravel kicked out a little bit, so I figured, oh, raccoon must have got in there and drank it or something. Well, we refilled it this morning, put it back out here, and in less than an hour, they've taken it down that far, which is probably, eh, probably less than a half gallon, but still, that's, that's less than an hour they've taken it down that far. And you can see how, just how packed they are in there. So we are definitely in a dearth. We're gonna keep open feeding these girls here until they're entrance feeders arrives and then we'll we'll feed them at the hives but uh, yeah I, I never I never imagined that bees could consume that much sugar syrup in in the time that they've done it you, you can almost watch it go down they're drinking it so fast but there's some open feeding with some very very thirsty girls and you can almost see them moving that gravel around to get down to that sugar. They're, they're drinking that sugar water faster than it can come out of the spout. Now yesterday, there were a lot of bees inside. So this morning I put a piece of hardware cloth over the hole so they can't get up inside. But there's some open feeding during a dearth. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Thumbs up. Any questions or comments are appreciated.